Here's how to escape the map of Lago and capture the flag. So, you want to go right in front of your flag, and then from here you want to go to the left, and you'll see this acacia sapling. You want to go to it, and then you want to place a block right here. Uh, in the front should be the acacia sapling, on the right should be a pot with a fern, on the left should be moss, and on and that at the back should be cobbled, oh, should be some deep slate, and then just pillar up, and pillar up as high as you can until you reach the height limit. And you know how when you reach the height limit, and you know how when you reach the height limit, when you place a block above the height limit, that'll get removed, it'll basically, it'll instantly get removed, it's, it's not instant, there's a bit of time where you can jump off the block like this. And you can chain it on walls. For this one, you only have to chain it on the wall three times and then land right over here, where you can see that I am right now. And then it, from, and from right here, you want to break through this iron bar with use your pickaxe and then walk through the iron bar. And then you'll be here. There's a bit of, there's like a, there's like a, and you can go inside here. There's like a bed. There's a couch and some thin stuff. And then after that, you want to uh, break through that bar and th break through that iron bar and go over here. Now you and from here you're kind and here you're kind of between two barriers, two barrier walls. There's a barrier wall over here and a barrier wall over here. But you can but to get out and to get out, you want to do the glitch a bit on the right over here in this corner. There's there should be barrier a barrier wall to your left and face the and face the visible wall. Do the glitch five times on the visible wall and then go over and you should be on top of here. You should be on this small like balcony. And then there's the inside, there's like a carpet, a bed, a chair, a table. And then to get out, you just want to jump off the other side, that you, the side, the opposite side that you, than the one that you came in from. And then there's a, quite a bit inside these buildings. You can go this way eat, and go over here. And then you can see the inside of the building, of this building, let's like oh, over here, it's not, I'm not sure what this is supposed to be, and there, um, there's, you can enter basically pretty much any house, and this is kind of like a small town out here, like there's a bunch of stuff you can explore, a bunch of houses you can go in, so I'll try not to show too much so that you can explore some of the houses for yourself if you like exploring. This is probably the best map to explore of all the ones I've escaped. Or at least one of the best maps to explore. Since it has a lot of stuff out of bounds. And so so this house has like got like a kitchen over here and a table. And then there's over here with the couch, the chair, the furnace, the is the like the living room, the table over there. There's a table over there. You can do a quick neo. Oh wait, and the, I don't I don't know what the composter is for. Oh, uh, okay. Then there's this like bathroom. Uh, over here, there's a bathroom, and then there's a bed over here, and uh, another bed, a uh, bedroom over here, and another bedroom here, and uh, there's I can go, and, and then there's. So, uh, and then there's some stuff up, up here, there's a building up here.
right up over here. As you can see, this, there's no inside. There's no way to go inside though, unfortunately. And then there's a windmill over here, and the, with the farm nearby. And you can also go back inside, and you can also go back inside the, where you started. And there will be some other er, areas, kind of like the two I showed you, the first two areas I showed you at the start. Well, thank you for watching. If you if you want to escape a different map. Although this is probably the best map to escape, then you can check out my the map escape playlist on my YouTube channel. But this is probably pretty easy, and this is probably one of the easier. This map is probably on the easier side to escape out of most of the maps I've escaped. So you'll so this is probably one of the better ones to try to escape, especially if you're. Or like a beginner with this glitch, and you was ju like just seeing the glitch now. Anyway, thank you for watching. Bye.